Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and if you're not here, welcome to the channel, and today we are going to be making a tier list of all the different uh, Nintendo consoles, so that's home consoles and handhelds and hybrids, or, you know, the hybrid. Um, yeah, so, before we get in, I would just like to say that I'm only going to be doing the ones that I, or like, ranking the ones that I have actually, like, played, like, enough to like actually like rate it like rank it properly you know so i won't be doing all of them but it seems like half of these are just like uh, different versions of the ds or like like uh, the game boy or something like that but yeah um <clears throat> oh yeah and also um uh, f uh feel free to leave your own ranking in the comments down below and i'll just remember to um and i uh, just remember to be respectful with uh, yours and other people's opinions, so like, just don't go around saying like, "Oh man, your opinion is so wrong and you're dumb" and stuff like that. Just like, don't say stuff like that. It's not cool. And let's get into this because this intro is already too long. Okay. So, the two DS. Um. So, so well, I mean, like, I own both the two DS and a new three DS XL, and they're mostly the same. It's just that the two DS. Well, it's, like, it's a bit smaller, I guess, and, um, it's a bit smaller, and, um, well, yeah, it's, like, I guess there's, like, not as many features, like, there's not, like, the auto brightness, and there's, like, a few other features, like, um, like, there's no Miiverse on the 2DS, I don't think, although that doesn't really matter that much anymore, um, so, I guess, I mean, like, I guess I'll put it in A, but it's, like, it's not even, but, it's honestly not, um, it's not that big of a difference, aside from the fact that once I dropped it on, like, a sort of, like, a paved tile floor or whatever. And, yeah, and then it's, like, the top right shell of it cracked a bit. So, yeah, I guess that's one thing. Um, but then the, wait, where is it? The new 3DS, the new Nintendo 3DS XL, which I also own. I mean... I guess it's like a bigger and I guess so depending on who you ask better version and honestly the so the 3ds slash 2ds slash ds or whatever like that family it's like it honestly is just like the best like like the definition of handheld in my opinion you know it's like it has great battery life great games great features um so the snes technically I haven't really played on an snes and we don't really own one but it's like we have the the SNES Classic Edition. So, just like going off of that. So, so let's say this is the SNES Classic Edition. It has some pretty fun games. A lot of classics. Um, So one of my favorites was the Kirby Golf game. I can't remember exactly what it's called at the moment. I think it's like Kirby's Star Course. Or not like, well, it's, like it's not that exactly, but something along those lines. I'll put it in B. Um... The Game Boy Advance SP, my first ever, well, I guess it technically wasn't mine, it was my dad's, but then he let me use it while he was at work. My first place to ever play video games, actually. Um, I mean, it it's kind of hard to go off on an unbiased opinion, so, so yeah, a few of these will be kind of biased, but. Uh, but but I mean like I but, but like I guess that's just I guess that's just what makes it more personal, I guess. So I'd probably put this. I guess I'll put it in B. Yeah, yeah, I'll put it in B. Um. The oh, what should we do next? Um, I guess the Wii U. Honestly, the Wii U. I've had so many great memories with the Wii U, and just like. I'm sorry, but if you're any background noises, um, yeah, it's my family in the background. Um, but the Wii U, honestly, is like it honestly is like just like one of the most underrated, uh, consoles in my opinion. And it's like I can see why it commercially failed because yeah, the ads. I mean, like the introduction ad at E3. Yeah, like that. It like it basically just made it seem like an like, you know, like it, like in addition for the original Wii, and then the other ads that you would find like while watching Cartoon Network or Nickelodeon or something. Yeah, those were really bad. But um, the one thing is though is that um, 
there ever was a time that like my cousins came to my house or like I go to my friend's house or like all my friends would come to my house or something like that we'd always play on the Wii U and we, like just like without a doubt we'd play like Nintendo Land the Mario 3D World um um I don't think we played Mario Kart 8 that much but we played hey hey Smash 4 just like tons of stuff and so just because there's so many great memories that I had with it I had to put it in S it's a bit biased, but it's just my, you know, it's just my memories and stuff. Um, the Wii. The Wii was my first ever, my first ever, um, like, it was my first ever console that was, like, not the Game Boy, I guess. But, but basically, this is what really cemented my love of video games, kind of, you know? Um... I would just, like, I'd look up videos for, like, how to do the secret stuff in uh, Wii Sports Resort, and I'd, like, like, I would try to play Mario Galaxy for, like, hours on end, but but it's, like, I was a bit younger back then, so I wasn't that good at all. But, honestly, it's my favorite Nintendo console. It was my first Nintendo console, and it's a bit biased, but I'm putting it in the highest of S tier. Um, okay. So let me think. Um, so oh, uh, this here is the Game and Watch. I technically don't have or have ever played a Game and Watch, but there is the Super Mario Bros. It's the thirty fifth anniversary Game and Watch, and and apparently it's a bit different, you know. But just like let's pretend that this is the Mario Game and Watch, right? It's a bit expensive at fifty bucks, and it also was only available for a limited time because of the anniversary and stuff, but. Um, yeah, but honestly, it, it has a really good battery life. Um, um, it took a few days, actually, for it to die, and that was only it being half-charged, and so, like, just, like, straight out of the box, just like that. I've, I've, I, um, I would put the Mario Game & Watch at C, personally. Okay, and now here's where we get, and now here's where things get a bit interesting. The Nintendo Switch. Highly loved by, like, everybody. I mean, okay. So, I don't know if I've ever seen this on the channel before. But I personally just, like, the Switch. I Okay. Okay, you know what? There, like, I could go off on so much stuff about what I don't like about the Switch. You know? But that's not this video. We're not doing this now. My dog is kind of getting antsy. Um, I think it's because he knows we're going to be going to go over some errands soon, but that's not the point. Basically, this video is not that video. I can make more videos about that later. The point is, I don't think I'll put it in F tier. It does have a lot of really good ideas. It's just the fact that they weren't implemented very well. It's just like, great ideas, very bad execution, in my honest opinion. Um, and I guess that just leaves the Switch Lite, which... I guess, I I mean, like, I, I technically don't own a Switch Lite, but my brother does, and then he lets me play on it sometimes. So, yeah, I mean, like, it does things better and worse than the original Switch, but it's, like, it's not really worse. It's just the fact that it's, like, yeah, like you know, it's, like, it, it drops the price a bit in favor for the fact that they dropped a few of the features. And, and I guess it's, like, it's a bit more portable than the Switch, since it's not the, there's not the fear of, like, all oh, the joy cons will fall off if it like hits something the wrong way or gets snagged on something although um yeah it's still not the most portable thing in the world but it's definitely more portable than the switch so i'll put it at d so this is my tier list of all the nintendo consoles that i have played um i don't think i've played any other ones i don't think i definitely haven't played it on the virtual boy but i mean like technically i have played on a ds but only like like once or twice in my friend's house but anyway this is my tier list. I'll share your thoughts in the comments down below. And just remember to be uh, respectful and stuff in the comments. And um, yeah, thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.